I might get there a little late because I'm gonna tend to me. I'm gonna tend to myself. We're having a girl's day. I'm having a me day. And I'm gonna take y'all along, okay? And we gonna just hang out today. to hit that subscribe button and let's hop right into today's video so first of all y'all know me and angel are constantly going back and forth between our home and my parents house i will stay up there for like weeks at a time so i normally have to pack a lot nobody wants to take multiple bags up and down the stairs so i had to find something big enough to fit mine and angel's things without like squishing it in there so i got a new suitcase okay period let's go ahead and unbox it it's right here is big she's big she's bright and truly just everything that I've been searching for I couldn't wait to show you guys this piece okay because first of all she comes with her own dust bag very classy very bougie very demure okay no seriously I cannot wait to get this bag traveling with a toddler is so much easier the less I have to worry about so just getting one big bag to put mine and his things in is what I needed so this this was definitely a smart choice let's get into the details shall we so this is actually a brand that i recently just came across called level eight and one thing i love about them is that they pay attention to detail like the yellow and black design the eights on the wheels okay this isn't just your average suitcase and it comes with two handles because i did get the biggest bag this is their 30 inch from their voyager collection and you get what you pay for with these suitcases okay the bag is built to endure with a german made macleron poly carbonate construction so she's light yet durable Taking a look on the inside, I am so grateful for this suitcase. I love the fact that both sides are just as deep, like they're equally deep, so I can have one full side for myself and then one full side for my toddler, my baby boy Angel. Packing our things in separate suitcases is now a thing of the past. I have enough room for both of our things and I couldn't be more excited because nobody wants to tote around multiple bags. I also love the fact that this has a wet and dry dry pocket so I can organize my things and you know just keep things nice it comes with 360 degree quiet spinner wheels of course for graceful maneuvering and you know it had to come with a TSA lock okay if your suitcase does not have this go ahead and click the link down below in my description box because you need a new one level8cases.com their merchandise ranges from travel gear to lifestyle concepts Anything you need, honestly, from backpacks to laptop bags to coolers, they've got it. Alex, Epps, take a look inside your heart. Is there any room for me? You get down on my knee because you only want to hold me when I'm looking good enough. Did you ever fool me? Would you ever picture us?
my channel and welcome if you are new here do not hesitate to hit that subscribe button so we're gonna hop right into today's vlog because today is a pretty special day today is a special day because sean doesn't have to work <gasps> My fiance does not have to work today, meaning, girl, he got the baby. So we can have a girl's day. Let's have a little girl's day today. I'm low-key sick because it's Labor Day and I was supposed to get my nails done. I need to soak them off, first of all, because what is this? I wanted to get my nails done, but girl, the shops are closed for the holiday. I'm like, I didn't even know everybody was really celebrating Labor Day like that. You feel me? But <laughs> I'm going to try to find a shop that's open because I want to get my nails done, girl. Like, I want to take advantage of this time. I'm about to go ahead and get a workout in. As you've seen earlier, we took a family walk. I love that. Like, I just love getting outside. And recently, I've been taking Angel on walks. But since Sean didn't have to work today, he came on the walk too. So that was cute. And then, of course, we stopped at Starbucks, which really defeated the entire purpose of trying to be healthy and go on the walk because y'all know those starbucks drinks be having hella sugar in it but i'm blaming sean <laughs> i am weak he is addicted to starbucks like seriously so anyways yeah we stopped at starbucks and then we came home sean and angel just left because since it is the holiday his family is having a cookout okay so he's heading over there early people aren't supposed to be there until like three girl it's one o'clock so i decided i might get there a little late because i'm gonna tend to me i'm gonna tend to myself we're having a girl's day i'm having a me day and i'm gonna take y'all along okay and we gonna just hang out today first things first we're getting this workout in it's leg day today and i just got some weights i'm about to show y'all these weights i just got girl they are adjustable weights and i'm really building my dream body like i am so serious like i know i've talked about like being on my fitness journey in the past but y'all you know y'all would still see me grubbing on cupcakes and doing all the things i wasn't serious but this girl i'm serious i'm so serious so and i actually ordered some weights so yeah let me show y'all the weights first of all and then we're gonna get into this workout and then after we do the workout i'm gonna soak my nails off shower and everything and get cute i want to curl my hair okay we're gonna curl the hair and it's just gonna be a good day today because i have time to tend to myself and you know just be a girl i'm just a girl and I like to do all the girly things. So, yeah, girl, spend the day with me. If you are new here, do not hesitate to hit that subscribe button. You my bestie, I'm your bestie, and we going through life together. I got this off the shoulder, y'all. Y'all know Rainbow? Like, I know the girls remember Rainbow. I, I'm pretty sure it's still around. I got this like years ago. They used to sell like cute workout sets and stuff. So I got like three. This is one of them, and I really wish this would just like sit up here but yeah <laughs> yeah the outfit is actually cute here's the little work outfit for the day these are actually oh i'm not wearing the pants that match these come with shorts that match i forgot i took them off i did have them on earlier but i took them off and just and just put on these because we went outside and everything so yeah we're in our pink all things girly so let me show y'all these weights they're actually right here I actually found these on Amazon, but Amazon was low-key trying to charge too much. So, girl, I took my butt to Timu, okay? Because Timu gonna, gonna just have the goods <laughs> for cheap, like for cheap. I'm sure these are the exact same ones they sell on Amazon, and they were less than $100. So, the maximum weight is 77 pounds. They came with, like, different sizes. I'm gonna have a picture of it like right here too so y'all can really see because I don't already like assemble them put them together but they're basically adjustable right you can connect them all and have like I don't even know what this bar is called but a long bar and then you can unscrew this part and then you'll have two separate dumbbells and then you also have a kettlebell so I'm like girl I'm really trying to like build my booty I'm trying to have an hourglass shape naturally obviously I'm not about to get a BBL but I want the look of a BBL 
So my goal is to really build my glutes whilst like still having like a toned upper body and everything else. And you know, period. All the girls want a big booty. Okay, I want a juicy booty. Thank you. <laughs> So we gonna build it girl. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and hop into my leg day workout. It is Monday, my leg days are Mondays and Thursdays. Let's go ahead and get into the workout. Oh, and I will have the link to these that I got off of Timu. If you do wanna check it out, maybe you're on your fitness journey too, girl, I don't know. took a shower and I'm trying to do my hair I really do not like straight hair on me when I naturally silk press out my hair then I like for it to be straight but whenever I got weave I'm gonna need to put some curls in it so that's what I'm doing right now I just made this U part unit with some new bundles I got actually off of Amazon I'm basically almost done I got this side done I still gotta do my little leave out and my edges, but girl, we getting it together, okay? It feels good to be taking care of myself again. I've always been the type of girl to always keep my nails done, always keep my hair done, like you can never catch me lacking. But motherhood takes that energy away because it really does take energy to keep yourself up like that. <laughs> but girl, I feel like I've been getting sucked into motherhood. I'm just trying to learn how to navigate. Girl, it's been an hour or an hour. It's been a year and a half. Angel is 18 months and I'm still learning how to navigate it. I don't know because some girls are just super organized and that's my thing. I just need to be more organized, have a set schedule every single day and that's what I've been trying to do. Like I've been waking up at 8 o'clock every day to work out. Today I actually woke up at 8 o'clock and was gonna work out, but Angel was up. And then Sean went ahead and went to the gym. So I just waited until Angel was knocked out, or not knocked out, but I waited until Sean took Angel to go ahead and do everything, like work out and stuff, because I know that, um, I knew that Sean was gonna be taking him. Did that make sense? I feel like I'm really rambling, but basically girl the gist of it all I'm trying to get a schedule down a daily schedule down and I feel like I've been doing good which is why I've been feeling better because I was really getting like in a funk I was in a funk for a minute but 
I feel good. I'm getting myself back. And honestly, just talking to Sean and letting him know that like my me time is legit, like not even an option. <laughs> Cause I will be depressed, okay? And I feel like in the beginning, maybe I was handling it well, but recently it's just been like getting, not harder. Yeah, it actually has been getting harder because Angel is awake longer, he's more active. So it's really not like I can multitask because I'll be having to watch him. Girl, Angel be needing all the attention, okay? Let me, let me tell you, like constantly, toddlers really just be doing stuff. They just be doing stuff just to be doing stuff. And you're like, what are you even doing? And then they hurt themselves. Like I'm constantly stopping him from hurting himself every day. It was this meme on Instagram. It was like, like being a toddler mom, you're basically just stopping your kid from killing themselves every day. And seriously, <laughs> Seriously, that is seriously the truth because they just be doing stuff. They just be doing stuff. But I need to be doing my stuff. <laughs> Let me take these out. I'm just wand curling my hair and pinning them up for a bit. So, well, basically just until they cool off so the curls don't fall. I would normally leave them in overnight, but I actually have somewhere to go. So I can't just walk around the house with these pins in my head. I'm doing good on time. It's 3.57, it's actually four o'clock. <laughs> I thought I was gonna be done doing everything earlier, but hey, it is what it is at this point, ouch. I've been burning myself all day. I got this burn mark earlier. I was putting Angel's things, or I was taking Angel's food out of the air fryer and I freaking got myself on the air fryer. That air fryer be high, okay? Okay, where's my flat iron? But yeah, the goal is to be over there by at least five o'clock. It's four o'clock right now and I still have to go to the grocery store because I want to do my grocery shopping this week just right now so I don't have to worry about Angel. Normally when I grocery shop, Angel is always with me like almost every single time. So, and I'm really not even going to do a full grocery shop because I really just don't even feel like, well, I could do it, but I also want to get to the cookout at a reasonable time. So here's my little cookout fit. Okay. Little basic girl. The majority of the clothes in my closet are black. Okay. So this is the fit. I got these shorts off of Amazon. It came in a pack of three, a black pair, a tan pair, and then like a darker mauve color pair, I guess. And then I just paired it with this black tank top. I'm gonna wear this jacket too. It is fall. It's 68 degrees outside, but it's supposed to cool off. The plan was just to jazz it up with this cute jacket. I love this jacket. I think I got this. I got this jacket from Halara. It's so cute. I just rolled the sleeves up. I think it's cute. Simple cookout attire. Okay, and then I was thinking about just wearing my shoes, my, no, I was actually just gonna wear some socks and my slides. <laughs> Let me go ahead and finish up my hair and then I will meet you guys in the car when we're going to the store.
tell you how good it feels to be prioritizing me again? Girl, thank you, Jesus. I feel so good. The saying is true, when you look good, you feel good. And I know I don't have like my nails done or even, even lashes on. But like my main thing is my hair. Like if my hair is done, I feel like I'm that girl, okay? So actually, we're just gonna go to the um, grocery store after the cookout. If I were to go to the grocery store right now, I wouldn't get to the cookout until like 6, 6.30. We gotta be there on a reason at a reasonable time still. Okay, your girl done got caught up in the self-care. Yes, ma'am. I'ma just holler back at y'all once it's time to go to the grocery store. I might vlog a tiny bit at the cookout. I might record a plate or something. I don't know. I'm really not even trying to eat like that though, to be honest. I'm serious about my fitness, girl. <laughs> So yeah, I think I just might have, I really don't know what they have, but I'm gonna try to limit myself so I don't overindulge because we getting this figure together, okay? I'm so happy to have my hair done. Ah, oh, thank you Jesus for hair. <laughs> I really love hair, girl. When having my hair done, I feel like I'm unstoppable. Like, and if my nails was done, don't play with that, girl. I feel cute again, y'all. <laughs> Moral of the story is, you look good, you feel good, okay? Period. MJ! I got it, I got it. We got it, we got it. We got it, y'all. Okay, period. Come on, Jesus. Jehovah Jireh. You've been with me through the fire. Giving up, not likely. No, the devil can't stop. Which one is it? It's this one? Yeah, it's this one. I'll park in front of my bay. I'll park in front of my man. Y'all wanna know something? Why did Sean, the other day, Sean told me, your dad must have taught you how to drive. <laughs> And then he said, because all you do is back in. That's one of your masculine traits. I said, <laughs> never, never. And then I told him why, right? Because my dad always taught me, like, if you ever need to get out of some place quickly, you want to make sure you could just, like, pull off, right? And then Sean was like, yeah, that's masculine. Because why are you even thinking about that? <laughs> Whatever. We're here, girl. It's 8.51, so at 9 o'clock, we put the bubbles, bubbles away, okay? Bubbles. Bubbles. I got your bubbles, baby. Can you count the bubbles? How many bubbles do you see? One. One of those. Let's count them, okay? Ready? Oops. All right, baby. I do bubbles. Count the bubbles. Yeah. Good job, baby. so wet so it's going down and not out mm. mommy's getting soaking <gasps> whoa bubble time it's bubble time <laughs> so many bubbles huh buddy 
Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, twenty-ten, twenty-eleven, twenty-twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Are you getting sleepy? Yes or no? Mommy sleepy. <laughs> bubble time. Bubble time. Bubble bubble pop. Bubble, 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 bubble time. Bubble time. Yeah, buddy. Hands. Hands. Do you want to hold my hands? Come on. You don't want to hold my hands. <laughs> he said, I got it. Just at first. You want to hold hands? You're so bubbles. cute. Bubbles. Bubbles. Your dad can do bubbles with you if you stay. You want to do bubbles with Dada? Yeah, he just want to go up and down the stairs, babe. <laughs> yeah. Get some what? Some dried fruit. Some dried fruit. Okay, I got you. These are our stuff, y'all. Sean and I love these. Let me get a few. Sean said he wanted the papaya. He said he wanted the papaya or the strawberry. I think I'm going to get Sean the papaya. Here's the strawberries. Those are like our healthy snacks, y'all. The dry fruit. But I got my list. Ranch cucumbers.
Okay, girl, so I wasn't even gonna go to the store, but I ended up coming. I ended up coming because I told myself I was gonna go, and I wanna start keeping my word to myself. Amen? <laughs> so, yeah, I told myself I was gonna go today. So, we went ahead and went. We went ahead and went. We were at home trying to do some bubble time with Angel. I think I'm gonna start doing 10 minutes of bubble time like every night before he goes to bed just to incorporate something new mm, my little smart baby yeah i was really thinking about putting angel in school at like age three what's the normal age for pre-k i feel like angel could go when he three <laughs> i am weak at this point he about to be two i'm about to be, about to be two in less than six months. Anyways, it's dark, girl. I'm gonna talk to y'all tomorrow. I don't think I'm really doing anything tomorrow. Do we have plans? No, Sean has to work. <laughs> I'm weak. So yeah, I was thinking about ending the vlog right here, but I don't know how long it's gonna be and I feel like I didn't really hang out with y'all like that for real. <laughs> so I need to edit these sponsorships. That's what's really teed. The sponsorships that need to be edited <laughs> and i keep procrastinating like girl get on your job what are you talking about <laughs> anyways i'm gonna holler at y'all